In this video, I'm going to talk to you about the LoSant Device Simulator. We're going to talk about why it's important and dig into its functionality. We created the Device Simulator to allow customers to test different features of the LoSant platform without hardware. For example, you'll be able to answer questions like, what happens to my application when my hardware stops sending data? How does my solution handle bad data? How could I test critical events of my solution? These are all questions you can answer with the Device Simulator. Let's dive in. To use a device simulator, you'll need to have a LoSan account that contains an application and a device. After you log in, go to your device. On the left hand side, you'll see Simulator. Once we navigate to that page, you'll see the simulator is disconnected. To connect, we just need to generate a key secret pair, then select Connect. On the right hand side is a device log. This shows a real time log of this device's activity. Once connected, there will be a message in the device log that shows the successful connection. Now that the device is connected, we can create a script to start generating some data. My device has four attributes, each of a different type, and we can simulate them all. We can simulate static and random values. I'm going to set all my attributes to send random data. When done, we can start the script. Now, you'll be able to see the data coming in through the device log. Now that our device is successfully connected and sending data, we can immediately go to a workflow and see this data coming in. Along with workflows, you can create a dashboard to visualize this data, test out integrations to other services, and so on. We would love to hear what you think of the device simulator. All of our features come straight from customers. If you have any ideas or requests, be sure to let us know in the forums.